So I used to do marching band. It was a lot of fun. I really enjoyed it. It was kind of a big thing for me. I'm, I was drum major uh, junior and senior year, and it was just, it was a big thing for me. But this past week, band camp started for the kids who are still in high school, but it's weird. It's a weird feeling. Um, it's not necessarily like sad or disappointed or doesn't even, I wouldn't even say it feels wrong that I'm not there. It just feels weird. For the past four years, I've had band camp for a week and a half before school started and now I don't and like it's still happening but I'm not there and it's weird. My friend Ben and I are gonna s probably stop by during their lunch break today to see everyone because that's another thing too. I'm so used to seeing everyone like everyone <laughs> and now that I'm not seeing any of them because they're all off at band camp and I'm not I'm kind of at a point right now where there's nothing really left to do. Even after the show ended and I didn't have rehearsals anymore, I had a book I had to read for one of my English classes. I had to finish cleaning my room. I had to get all the supplies I need for college. I had to pack stuff away. And I finished those things and there's still one, two, three, four, five. It was 12 days until I leave. I've got nothing to do. I think I'm gonna watch Star Wars. I've never seen the Star Wars movies. We have them all on DVD, but I've never seen them. So I've decided that um, for the next six days or so, I'm gonna watch a Star Wars movie every day. And I'm just gonna get through them. Gotta see them before I go to college. Speaking of movies, I saw Ant-Man yesterday. It was fantastic. I really enjoyed it. There were a lot of really funny moments. There were a lot of really cool different things going on. I thought it was really good. I I never really had a lot of friends in my own grade, but I had a lot of friends in the grades, the grade above me and below me. A bunch of my friends already went to college, but they're fairly local, so they've been commuting or like even or one of them does live on campus, but uh she's close enough to be able to go back and forth whenever she wants. And then but the friends of mine that are younger are still in high school, of course. But so, I'm the only one that's leaving when school starts this year. Because, like, when the others started college, they didn't leave. Like, they, they, were, they stayed local so we could still see them all the time. But I'm leaving. But hopefully, we'll, a bunch of us will do something before I leave because... It's gonna be weird not having them around or not being able to see them all the time. Cause like, they're my best friends. And I know they're still gonna be my best friends. I know they're still gonna be here and we'll, we'll still talk and text and Snapchat and all that stuff. But I think that's the weirdest part about going to college is that I'm not gonna be seeing my friends or family. But at the same time, it's going to be so great and I can't wait to leave and get started, but I'm also going to kind of like the next 12 days where I still get to be here and I still get to see everyone. Anyway, I have some interesting news because, because wait, wait, give me a sec, give me a, a sec. I found post-it notes. I can make dinosaurs out of these. Start, start. Getting that number high, a little higher up than it has been in its stationary place for quite some time now. So yeah, that's that. I'm gonna head out. See you guys next week. The week and a half, a week and a half, for a week and a half, before, I'm used to seeing everyone for a week and a half before school starts. I can speak English, I promise. <laughs>